I remind you because you forgot. Yeah, I remind you because you forgot. It you was forgot. an applesauce could be used. Oh, sorry, you could define no, applesauce. No, it was one plus one can equal applesauce, not applesauce okay, can Joel. be used. As what? Sure. That was... Yeah, uh, let me just get... Wait, why am I asking a lesson, nigga? For Infinity this, check like, chat, bro. Infinity check chat. That was, that was yeah. poor for me. Apple. So you want us to start? Shush. Shush, shush, shush. So what did I say? Uh, the meaning conveyed by the symbol two could be conveyed by anything, even a physical rock, even a physical rock. Yeah. One what does that even mean? Apple. Hold on. What does that even mean? Can I clarify, that please. Hello. You could what define that anything as anything. You can define anything as anything. Yeah, oh, you, say, could, like, oh, you don't yeah, think? I could call you a Jew, and by Jew, I could like be trying to convey it. But fast. yeah, but beforehand, you said tautology exists. Yeah, as in words are tautological to the definition being invoked by the speaker. So when I say you're an okay. apple, I re- wait. When mm-hmm. I say you're an apple, that is identically meaning to me saying you are a re- presumably red fruit with a stem that comes from an apple tree. Those convey the same meaning. So you know, so you think that just like definitions are subjective? No fuck. Do you think language is prescriptive? Um, I don't. I don't think language is like subjective. Like any linguist will tell you that it is personal. Uh, there is no debate to be had here. You're just wrong. The only oh yeah, you can say like whatever. The yeah, only one linguist that actually says that. No, it's only one linguist that actually says that. Wait, we can just do this very simply. The only country, and I'm aware of, that even has a body that arbit- like has any form of arbitration of language is France. Can you point to any authority that could? Wait, make before we get into that, can you send lo- one linguist that actually says that? Just, just like suffice sure. your burden of proof real quick. Okay, sure, go ahead. <sighs> also, don't say that. Also, if you say prove, not prove it. Let me just ban word list. You can think that. That's the claim. That's in question. If you say any of those, I'm just, just get, just get the, just get the fucking evidence. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, that's it. I mean, that's what it was. Uh, 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 you don't hey, 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 let's relax. Let's relax. I'm blue. Just I hate to have to fuck somebody up. Relax. Oh, shit. Oh, is that shit. fuck you? Is that honey? Yes, that's the big honey, bro. Fuck I'd be scared if I were you, Infinity. I'd be scared. No, you're not. I'm not even Infinity. I'm scared. You said what? What happened? That's him. Damn, it was taking a lot of time said... to get the evidence, bro. No, this motherfucker not... just said run Beyblade in verse. Okay, with you. however, modern linguists insist that value judgments about language should be recognized as such and should be examined in the light of the fact. Uh, that was not English. Person, which is what you're asking for, a linguist. <clears throat> You got the evidence, bro? I don't know what you said. It's hard to make up what you're actually saying. You sound like this struggling to get the evidence. No, it's it's not about whether or not I sound like a nerd. I don't 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 need observations from me about how I talk. Okay, bro. You got it. I know. So, I don't know. I'm what? Bo- okay. So, again, like, what arbitrary t- body like implies that language is prescriptive? I can't see anything. Oh, so you can't. G- okay, so you can't suffice. I already you know, do you want me to, Again, I can show you fucking science. I was or... saying, show me, not saying coded, bitch. Are you stupid? What the fuck are you talking about? I was saying, send the evidence, you idiot. Where's the evidence? Again, don't hey, without idiot, saying send derogatory evidence. ways send when it. you sound how you sound. Stop it, stop What? What huh? are you even talking about, bro? Yeah, you bitch. What? Like, no, it, it doesn't work. 
I don't know what you're talking about. While he's at school, just don't speak to me in any negative manner. You're you. Uh, Can we just get back to the debate already? <laughs> so do you think you saying R? Um, okay, can you define R for me? Can you define sh for me? Can you define all you words that you use for me? Right means. I mean, since language is subjective, I'm gonna have to ask you to define everything. Just like get clarity from you. So, go ahead. so I don't see an issue. Yeah, what's that. fine? Define fine for me. Fine is what I mean by fine. What do you mean by fine? What I mean by fine. Sports logic. Okay, okay, that's circular though. Like, that's it's not logical, but it's still not a definition. Oh, fucking Ta tautology is not a definition. Hello, tautology is not a definition. Please stop I'm going circular. Saying, it's the fine. I'm saying we define the thing by itself. No, you said it's tautological. After I said you should define it, tautology is not a that's definition. Fine. So again. Should... If my entire position is that any definition eventually reaches her character because all definitions are identical by the word you're anchoring the definition upon, it is fine for me to say that kill yourself means kill yourself. That's no issue under my stance. That, that, wait, you, you <laughs> conflated <laughs> tautology with definition. Like fucking words? Are, are you stupid? I, like, I, you I, conflated I, 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 definition with tautology. Are you stupid? Are you stupid? You want to conclude, bro? Hmm? Like, you, you just got beat up like pretty badly. Yeah, yeah, I got beat up. Yeah, your entire argument against me is a thing that I stated originally. You realize the whatever you say is trivial because definition language is subjective. Right, there's invoking a circular definition. <gasps> the humanity. Yeah, like no fucking shit. Next, I'm gonna tell you. Uh, that I like you you realize whatever you just said is trivial because language like is just subjective. Like, define well, whatever you said again. My own fucking position. And yeah, define I whatever you said again. Of my position, uh, I since you can't give, yeah, you, since you can't give your you argument, I just give my argument. You can't nerd. use you I'm, can't use apple sauce as a variable for two because apple sauce is not identical to two. Like, and if that's the case, since apple sauce is not identical to two, you cannot use this as a variable. So therefore, apple sauce cannot equal one plus one from two. You cannot infer apple sauce. Talks, from one plus one. Ladies, 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 why, go one why is time. Packing? Why are you packing? Like, the main argument against the thing I stated. You're not going to contend my right? argument. What argument do you want me to contend? What new ground? Okay, so you are not, so you are not, so you are not no, listening. Manji, Manji, do I sound case? Greek? Yeah, do you I sound Greek. Spanish? Do I sound? Yeah, oh, yeah, on. you sound retarded too. It's hard, it's hard to you make up. You sound retarded. You sound retarded. Anyway, what are you saying, Toxic? Are you are you gonna contend my argument or not? What argument? You gonna contend my but what argument? So you didn't hear what I said. Which one? The one where I spoke about how you cannot use like like applesauce to say placeholder for two. I that's your position. Well done. You reaffirmed your original style. I said argument. You stupid fuck. Are you gonna take? Are you gonna contend the argument? X? The argument where you said X is in fact you not saying X. Okay, never mind, bro. We can conclude. We can leave you here. You stupid. Yeah, we're done. <laughs> oh wow, you're an amazing debater, Plutus. All right, since all words are subjective, everything you just said, right then, toxic, actually all means I concede via my definitions. Therefore, you. Yeah, what the fuck That's is what happening? I'm saying. He just trivialized all of his words. What the actual fuck is happening? I was like listening to this for like five minutes. I have no idea what was happening in the whole debate. You guys were saying random shit. Like, Stop fuck? fucking whispering, bitch. <laughs> I'm talking. Shut up, bitch. Fucking bitch. You know what bitch. Where is You're infinity, whispering and you cutting out, bro. Like, it's like... I'm tired. I'm tired. I haven't slept. I'm tired. Oh, nigga, I'm back. What are you saying? The I'm last thing he said is that he wanted no. to conclude. You want to? Oh, that's yeah, crazy. Yeah, the last thing he so. said. Yeah, the, the what? What are you saying? What? what do you want to say? Don't be shy. Repeat yourself, toxic. I would. I don't buy it. What? What, what were you saying? About? I don't buy it. What were you saying? What were you saying? Is that better? Can you oh, understand me? That's, that, that, that's the last you thing that I said. Speak by you. Do I need to talk like this so you can better understand what I'm saying? Like what? Do what were you saying? Uh, so we should conclude. 
Why? I don't, it's just, I don't think anything with you is worth doing yeah. anything. Do, do, do you have any argument then? I already gave my argument. I continue your argument. Yeah, you I think Hackman's fucking retarded. I, I'm fading to Yeah, you can think reason. that. Right? Shh. Yeah, you can think that. Shh. that. Okay, that was <laughs> one of three things I told you not to say. That's strike one of one. Don't do it again. Anyway. Of course, you can think that. <laughs> and I don't do second chances, so I'm just gonna talk while you're muted if I feel like ooh, I'll meet. Ooh, this is cool. Anyway, so yeah, toxic. I don't know. Like I'm fans to anyone that's convinced by what you're saying. I think what you're saying is retarded. So beyond me just saying that A, your position you didn't give a good argument, right? Like your main argument was Oh, well, you said I said something circular in my definition when that's my entire position. That was fucking retarded and a waste of your breath, right? Like, no fucking shit. The person saying definition is circular provided a circular definition. Like, that was dumb, right? There's nothing worth engaging with that. There's also, like, you telling me the language is prescriptive while failing to provide anybody that could arbitrate language in a way that would make it prescriptive, right? Like, it, it's actually implausible for English to be prescriptive. And you failed and have still not managed to... Shh. Who's muted? Okay, Plutus, you cannot get a mod. Okay, I understand that. I understand that. Can you get a mod? Just get someone who's on Me. staff already I'm to moderator. moderate. I'm you moderator. can't moderate your own debate. Nobody what are you talking about? Moderating. He didn't agree to you moderating. I'm, I'm sure Toxic will agree to a different moderator that oh, isn't yourself. Ma okay, okay give Maki VC perms, man. Okay, I'll, I'll, give, I'll give. Okay, Maki can have VC perms. Cool. Yeah. Maki's my go. Like, I, I love Maki. Like one time, like a bang cam, Marky like kissed me behind my ear, and I loved it. You know, he like licked it. But anyway, where's VC cool, mod? Have you given him the perms? Where the fuck is VC mod at? Am I blind? It's, just give him sight for pollen remover later. You only. Oh, have I found it. Him. Okay, there. Okay, unmute toxic. My okay, cool. There. Yeah, no, you staying on mute, bro. Can I contend? Can I contend what yeah, he said? No, I'm like, going. I'm going to meet. I'm going to meet you because I, you I was still talking. You already made. Marky, you have like five seconds, and if I beat you to I beat you to it, right? Like, he's gonna make uh, multiple points. You already made a point, three. can I contend it? Yeah, I am. You're gonna cry about it. Two, Okay, that's, one. That, that's shot. Cool. So, Marky, like, if you're moderating, can you moderate? Like, this nigga was speaking while I was speaking. Like, like you're a moderator, please. Like, I love you, but you're already testing my... um. Devotion right now. Cool. So that's what I was saying. Soon for a to the point. So Marky, can you now moderate? Like you have enough time. What do you can I continue your point? See, this is why he needs to You literally made a point. I'm not gonna let you meet my point. About it. I don't give a fuck, Marky. That's please. shotgunning. Hello. Okay. And fuck you no. Know. So yeah, you didn't one the circuit points retarded, two, there's no way for it to be prescriptive. I already asked you, you didn't demonstrate anything. I was I meant to like pray for some system to continue to exist that would justify opposition. Three, yeah, I don't know. There's also no way for you to demonstrate that Applesauce doesn't actually just mean to, right? Uh, like, that's fucking weird. And that's gonna like point at some objective understanding of the English language. Which is fundamentally retarded because you sound like a nerd, which means that you do not exist in normal society at a high enough level to tell me shit about how anyone speaks because you don't speak to people outside of Discord, right? So that's a final contention. I don't understand how you as a person would know enough about English to tell me what words mean in English, right? Like, if I go in your message here, I want to see more fucking seven-syllable words than I'm going to see for any other normal person. You frankly do not speak English, right? You speak some weird geek babble, like the average Star Wars fan. Like, I don't value your understanding of what words mean. So if I... Yeah, okay, you can mute me now. I don't care. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Anyways, um, I'll contend the first point again. You tried to justify the fact that this specific definition in question can be circular, even though you use tautology and explain to you how tautology is not a definition, so you cannot use that. So I don't know why you keep going back to it and saying, like, definitions are circular. As for the point about me not justifying whether or not they're prescriptive, I already justify how they're likely prescriptive because everything you say will be trivialized if they're not prescriptive. 
Therefore, if you're gonna go under the presupposition that they're not prescriptive and you make the specific position that one plus one can equal applesauce, we're gonna have to ask you to define that as well. We don't know what the definition or what it would mean when you say one plus one can equal applesauce. That trivializes the entire definition, all words and meaning of the words themselves. And as for the last part, I already justified that, but you just didn't hear the justification, so I'm not gonna repeat that. That's just the you problem. But yeah, that's yeah, what I think I've done here. Oh, okay, so you don't go. So one, the last point I just brought up, um, unless you have fucking future sight, like your Ichi bear, I don't know how fuck you responded to it, but I digress. So again, like the circuit, point, like everything you're saying, like the language becomes trivial. Uh, like the words lack meaning. I, I don't care. I, this is if your argument's purely based on convenience, I don't give a fuck. It can be inconvenient. Uh, that's on you. That's not my issue, right? Like things don't cease to be true just because they're problematic for you. So yeah, like telling me the words lack meaning, or it's going to be hard to convey information, changes nothing about the actuality of if this thing is prescriptive or not, which it isn't. And then again, like the tautological thing, you're just being dumb. Uh, like outside of just giving you the definition, telling you to read it slowly with your fucking glasses on, there's no real way for me to convey this to you because it's literally. At least I'm because you're saying it's prescriptive, something that should be inarguable, right? Like Where did that nigga just say, bro? Oh no, I know you gave the I know you gave the argument right now. You just said I did not like justify it or whatever. You talk about that last point, but I already did. That's the point. I don't care whether or not you made the point right now, it doesn't matter. I already justified it beforehand. You didn't contend that. Like literally. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Yeah, you didn't justify it, right? And also, A, you can't prove justified it. B, you're not smart enough to justify it. C, actually, it just really didn't have, which is just a reaffirmation of what I said before, A. But anyway, yeah, you just really just didn't attack the entire point of like, a reason for it being prescriptive, not mattering. It doesn't change the truth value of anything. Um, right. If I like tell you it's fucking. If I like told you you could go past the speed of light because under Newtonian physics it makes more sense, right? There's no implication under Newtonian physics that relativistic effects would require infinite energy to be past the speed of light. That's perfectly reasonable, right? And then for an object of one one kilogram, I could tell you it requires like X energy to move past the speed of light, and because that's convenient and what you described to me earlier, it will be perfectly okay and true, at least seemingly true, for me to say the speed of light is not the highest possible speed. We know that isn't true in spite of its inconvenience, because it isn't consistent with other observations. In this case, the observation required for language to be prescriptive would be some sort that could arbitrate what is and is not the correct usage of language. In, this, in spite of that thing's existence, prescriptive language could not exist because there is nothing to prescribe definitions, right? It's a non-starter. It's like me telling you that like your objects with the most attractive woman on earth but there's also no standard that describes the fact, a fucking like observed attractiveness. Like it is incon, like it's internally inconsistent. Like you're requiring something that does not exist to justify your position, and then even though we both know that thing doesn't exist, you're just moving and breezing past it like it isn't an issue. And also, again, back to the circularity thing, you're still just fucking. Nuts. And again, do you want me to show you the definition? Because I think at this point, you just need to see what a tautology is. Because there's not much more I can do with that. It's like you telling me you don't know what... Like me telling you an apple's red, when a picture of a red apple, and you say, hmm, I don't know if that's a red apple, right? Um, like, the fuck? It's pretty observable and obvious. Why is this a debate, though? Anyways, can I... Oh, okay, so anyways... <sighs> this is a stupid debate. But um, your your first point is a circular reasoning. You want to know why? Because you literally just said um, language cannot be prescriptive because there's literally nothing that grounds language be prescriptive. And you also said language cannot be prescriptive or whatever because... Well, what do you actually say, bro? I think you said something like language cannot be prescriptive strictly because there's nothing that can prescribe language. That's circular reasoning. Moving on, um, yeah, you can give whatever definition for tautology, even though tautology is just like a self-referential thing and like propositional logic. It doesn't really mean much. 
Also, if you're going to presuppose that tautology exists, you're presupposing that language is prescriptive to a sense, right? I don't know why, because if you're going to say, like, for example, if you have the laws, three laws of thought, and the three laws of thought ground something like tautology, and the three laws of thought are themselves, and we know the objective meaning of the three laws of thought, and they're conveyed via language, therefore language is likely prescriptive even under your worldview. I don't know why you were yapping by Newtonian mag mechanics, like that actually pertains to whatever we're talking about. But yeah, the, the, you can set the definition, dude. Like, So I uh, think as you kind of understand me again, I want to speak the way that he kind of understand to make it easier for him. So, um, one, uh, the new title feels pretty fucking simple, right? It's literally just uh, convenience doesn't equal truth, and the convenience of something says nothing about this thing is in accordance with reality. In the same way that Newtonian physics is inaccurate, your prescriptive understanding of language is also inaccurate. These are equivalent meanings, right? And then when we go to the prescription of language, it's not circular. It's me saying we would have to have some adjudicator body to give us the true definition in order to say language is prescriptive because it needs to be prescribed. That's a function of it being prescriptive, correct? And uh, by virtue of this thing not existing, any intelligence of it, at least direct intelligence of it, may also not be able to exist. It would say with if no women exist, there will be no childbirth in humans, right? It means, it's pretty fucking obvious. Uh, okay, so it's not circular, it's just you being a fucking retard, right? Um, and I'm not sure I'll like, give you the definition of a uh, tautology, right? I think that should help you out here, because I, I really you know, like, this is pretty fucking basic. So, let's Google tautology on uh, the google.com. And also, after this, I'll get to why me using this definition isn't um, uh, defeated to my own position. But I feel like that's pretty basic, so it should only take a sense or two. Tautology definition. So, a tautology is the same, the same thing twice over in different words, generally considered to be a fault of style. That's what definition should be good. So, in the same way that we say, Toxic is a fat Jewish bastard. It's the same as we saying toxic is toxic because toxic conveys and is identical to the thing of a fat Jewish bastard, right? These are identical. Uh, and the reason why I've since defeated my position is that while language itself is not prescriptive, because we are all raised in a society that speaks with language, we will all be raised with general, leave the same understanding of the language. That says nothing about if this is the correct way to use it. It's just it is learned in a way that leads to this form of consistency. That's different than saying this is how it ought to be, which is the claim you'd be making if you were saying it's prescriptive. I am not giving any value judgments of saying this definitely is good or bad i'm just saying this is and it is because it's most likely i'm going to understand it to be right i could say zimbabwe blop, 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 and that would be equally accurate but it's less likely you know what i mean by that right anyway you can mute me now i am done talking like toxic oh, fuck, I hope. Yeah, he did not contend my point about how like the three laws of thought entail the him like pertain like like assuming that these three laws of thought like entail the fact that language is indeed prescriptive or presuppose that. But in any case, um, that definition of tautology is like false. That's just like one of the rules of inference at best. But I don't think that's tautology to begin with. Like if you're gonna say, for example, um, X is identical to Y, right? Maybe for example, you describe toxic to be a black man and toxic to be fat or something, right? And you say that's identical to toxic, right? That's not even tautology to begin with. Tautology is something that's self-referential. Like, for example, if I say Kezi, then that means Kezi is just Kezi. It doesn't mean that I'll just describe him as like a fat nigga. Therefore, that's Kezi. That sounds like a rule of inference. That's just like an inferential step, right? That's just like an antecedent that affirms the consequence. That's not even a, like a tautology to begin with. So the definition of tautology is just like fucking stupid and retarded and you're not content what I said. So if you think you contend on what I say, we can just like include and leave the debate here. Like because you sound retarded as fuck. Mute me. I will say, talking like you hurt my nose a lot, so I, I shan't be doing this again. But one, there's an argument you saying that the definition is retarded when I gave you a dictionary definition, right? There is a point where you're going to have to tell me what definitions you are hinging on for your prescriptive understanding of language because you can't be using dictionaries. Um, you could just say the definition of retarded. That's fine. But that's not consistent with your own position. I'm fine with you saying the definition of retarded, but that doesn't work under your view. 
to what you said about I didn't respond to what you said about Laws of Logic because it wasn't relevant. It's like for talking about inverse Naruto, and then you tell me Goku Black has a bigger dick than Majuta. I'll go Goku Black wins. And uh, it means nothing. Like the same way your argument was so fucking irrelevant, there's no need for me to respond to it. The laws of logic exist and does not tell anything about anything else. You cannot reach anything from that, right? Um one, like for example, the fact that subjective things exist in reality and tells the laws of logic in themselves existing is not enough to make everything like objective, or at least everything in a prescriptive function, the same way that you could say it is correct or incorrect. Um now the relevance of the debate to irrelevant to this to the debate is when we are describing them that I'm saying is personal. I'm not telling me the laws of logic do something that would make this thing prescriptive. You are telling me there is something transformative about the laws of logic that would make the acceptance of the necessarily universal. This is not the case. For example, aesthetic judgments by people are not, you cannot prescribe them. You cannot say X is universally understood to be aesthetically pleasing because that's not how it works. Even though the laws of logic exist. They are still not. They are still purely subjective, and they pure, still purely describe an individual's feeling towards something. Right? It was a different thing. So that's why I didn't respond to that. I didn't think I need to make that clear to you. But you're also a nerd, so even though you were pissed, my I should have known that. Two. Um. Actually, no. This is, this is, yeah, I remember this. So final point, toxic. Um. You're dumb. Don't speak to me again. And you might be the dumbest person. No, not dumb. That's rude. You might be the most mentally challenged person I've had the displeasure of interacting with in months. So for my sake and your sake, because I don't like being a cunt, don't displeasure me or, like, darken the ground beneath you by interacting with me, okay? So, like, after this, pretend I'm dead or you are dead. And ignore me, because I don't want to be a cunt. No one said the laws of logic are subjective, you dumb... This is why I can't talk to nerds, bro. I, I, I speak basic English, like the English you learn in school. Like, say, the laws of logic being not subjective doesn't mean things that you have described by them must also not be must also be not subjective, right? And then I ground that in aesthetics. Pretty fucking obvious. Like, my point is one thing doesn't need to be other. But for some fucking reason, you're so mentally challenged. Like, devoid of fucking basic technological fucking ability that you are able to completely misconstrue my statement to be the laws of logic are subjective? Like, no. Kill yourself. You're dumb. Don't reproduce. Don't have children. Just die, please. Anyway. Fucking hell, you can- <sighs> Okay, anyways, so um since the laws of logic are objective and they're not subjective, then whatever they grant is also objective and not subjective. And if that's the case, if something is A and A is some specific definition, then it's oh, analytical to choose gone, so, that definition. Yeah, I don't care. I'm just gonna talk to moderators as well. Oh yeah. So, oh yeah, so whatever. Um so, yeah. the definition you think the laws is of logic describes right? aesthetics? The- you think the laws of logic describe aesthetics? I don't it's think that's relevant. relevant, but anyways, um, no, to say that the laws of thought are actually objective. I'm off the laws of logic describe aesthetics. Oh that's my god, I... can we get a new moderator? Let me get some no, Kazuki here. Do you think the laws of logic describe aesthetics, yes or no? I think Is they describe everything, question? yes. yes or no? If, if, they, if, if laws of thought, yeah, if the laws of logic are objective, then they're universally applicable, so therefore they describe anything, yeah. Okay, do you think aesthetic judgments are universal? Okay, do you now think people have, like, prescriptively understood universal aesthetic judgments? Do you think it is the case that people would determine X being universally to be, like, beautiful? Yes or no? Uh, I mean, there could be some sort of, like, objective no, meaning no, for that. I, no, so or, again, the, if you're saying this, no, because I mean, I'm just, saying... If it's the word beautiful, then the word beautiful is beautiful, logic, so yeah. Does it mean this thing... Pardon? Uh, yeah, if like if like the if like the word beautiful is beautiful, so yeah, it is beautiful. And we define beautiful, like, specifically, yeah, it is beautiful. So I don't see your point. So then, if you say your dog is beautiful, must I also agree that your dog is beautiful? No, I'm saying if the word beautiful is beautiful and we define beautiful That's in irrelevant. a way that I'm which arg- fits the actual, definition I'm just of going beautiful, to ram- again, then, your argument is, then your argument it does not pertain to what I said. What? No, but if it I does, say my dog is beautiful, I... doesn't mean that it's true. That's not how the, that's not how the laws of logic work. That's not 
talking to you about. What I'm saying is the laws of logic exist and says nothing about the prescriptiveness or descriptiveness of anything that they describe or anything that exists upon them. In the same way that while... I already gave the argument as to why they didn't do it. In the same vein that things can be beautiful or ugly on an observer base level, right? Like I could observe something to be ugly and then you could observe the same thing to be beautiful because references are being generated by us and they're not solely contingent on the thing being observed. That may also apply for definition in the same way that I could see the same word as you and understand it to mean something different. In the same way that, um, okay, let's choose words. When I write the word die in English, I understand it to mean ceasing of living. In the, but a German person will may understand it to mean the, right? So we have the same observation. We, we interact with the same word, but the meaning gained from this word is different. There is no universal prescribed definition of die, D-I-E, because even cross-culturally, let alone people in the same culture, the word serves different functions. The word die in German does not mean anything similar to the ceasing of living. Yet in order for your argument to work, you would either have to say, specifically within English, that now exists this ability for things to have universal meanings, which again requires something to ground these meanings, or be you'd have to say there is a universal understanding of what D-I-E means, and then you'd have to either say the English definition is wrong or the German definition is wrong, or you'd have to say they're all correct, mm. because there is no grand reason for why I should accept one of them over the other. Mm. Be basic. Yeah, there's a false equivalence. Like if if you if you're using the German language, of course it's gonna be a different like language and they're gonna have like different forms of how they convey yeah, their semantics. Awesome. But if well, you're talking well, about in the context of English, I, but I let you well, I literally guys, let you speak guys, and I just guys, and I just No, you could have tried to cut me off. I have no issue with that. I, 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 I literally just let you finish, but okay, and sure, I, fine. I, I, the fact that I cut you off means I'm okay if you cut me off. Are themselves. So I don't know why you use something like Germany, right, where Germany, they use a yeah. different language and convey whatever yeah. they say, right, whatever the semantics that they convey in a different sense, which is just like a different language. I'm saying like language is universally applicable in reference to like a specific language, not like a, like, Different languages just like mean the same thing. Like that's not what I'm saying. And I'm maybe saying in the context of German, German language, yeah, maybe in the context of like German yeah. language, die doesn't mean die in what we mean in English, but die means die in Instead English. Either way, so. Well done, well done, well done. And I'm saying everyone so has their I'm saying everyone in the same English language differently. Uh, go. We can all have different understandings of words in the same way that German first and then die to mean something different. I could understand applesauce means something different than you. Like, there is no differentiating factor between how a German person can understand die differently to how I can understand die differently. And then if I, one I, 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 I already way, gave you the argument. You want, like, no, 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 no. No, you said they're different languages. I'm now going to give an example of within the same language how people that speak the same language can understand what they are different. Mm. So, let's use my favorite word, faggot. You are a faggot. You are a homosexual man. There are places in the United Kingdom where faggot does not mean a homosexual man, it means a cigarette. Because the language is slightly different. Hello? It's the same I language. The it is, it is the bit. same language. I said slightly you different. I said slightly different. Okay, but pause. I said why slightly different. Everyone, why can my English not be slightly different? For example, we use different words when we speak. You just, you just, you just lagged out. Repeat what you said. You just lagged out. Repeat why what you said. Could the way, why could the way that we speak language also not be different? We speak what I say words differently to you. I say use different words than you. My sense structure is different than yours. Even the way I type is different than yours. If we're going to say that different parts of England can use English differently, why yeah, can we not di just be we the type differently because you use different words? Like, what? It no, doesn't mean that the type. words themselves so, no, 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 are no, 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 we're saying different. Wait, if we're I saying. You're being, you're being, you're missing me. Type of. We're breaking you, down the English language into different then, groups. Then, then right? speak properly. Don't, don't speak. There's like, nothing I'm saying wrong. It's your lack of understanding. Do you no, want it's, me to, like, it's your you lack of ability to convey things properly, fucking retard. Yeah, my it's your lack of ability to like nigga, I would kill any that's rude. I also, that's by rude. the way, if you're gonna say but, um, just because no, an observer, anywhere. like an observer A like, I can, I, makes a claim that I don't care if it's absurd, I don't care if it's absurd, I I accept the whole lot of it could be absurd. It could be absurd, I don't care. It could be absurd, it could be absurd. It could be wrong, hello. It could be absurd, it could be absurd, it could be absurd, it could be absurd, it could be absurd. Yeah, the other one could be wrong. You're not continuing what I'm saying. So the, the entire the like analogy observed. using observation or different observers like having different ways of conveying things is just wrong. Just one one person could be wrong. There it is. It's just that simple.
Stupid one thing. person could we pause. I'm not saying one person has to be right. I'm not saying we all have to be right. I'm saying they would I understand. never said you said that. I'm the one who's saying that you fucking retard. Oh my god, can you please track? Hello? So either you're not like moderation was literally saving your ass. Like there's no moderation now. You're getting beat up. I you are referencing earlier like, when I said was literally saving your ass. The same thing when it's me difference. If it's not the latter, I don't care and it's not relevant to the conversation. Okay, so, so the entire point wrong, about right? you using the analogy of observers doesn't matter anymore. Thank you. Are you stupid? I'm saying, wait well, again, so we're talking about the observer analogy, which means when I said that's not what I was saying. The observer analogy doesn't work. Using... I, already gave you, yeah, I already gave you an argument, so why do you observe analogy doesn't work? So, that's not showing it's void. They could be wrong, but doesn't mean they're necessarily wrong. Your argument wouldn't tell me they're unnecessarily wrong. Yeah, yeah that's what I'm right. saying. It's necessarily wrong so, because yeah, of how the So, for example, if I tell you, so let's look at the color I... purple, right? Yeah, sure. Shh. Yeah, sure. Let's look at the, the color purple. Go ahead. Yeah, this is the color purple. Like, I'm what fuck. are you saying? This when you sound like Stop you. Stop repeating that. Stop repeating that. No, no, no. I have to keep repeating. I have to keep because every time you say that, here from your fucking give lungs. Your argument. Stop repeating. Stop. 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 I will give an argument when I feel like giving an argument. You can cry about it, but I was anyway. So. Yeah, you won't give your argument because you're getting shit on. When I say that purple is good, when I say purple is beautiful, I almost when I says purple is ugly. Do you understanding that the vast majority of people to get from us is that I like purple and the person dislikes purple. But it would take a special kind of autism. That's a preference that has nothing to do with language. That's just a preference. That's just a preference. That has nothing to do with language. That's just a preference. 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 That's just Basic social cues. Oh shit, sure. this nigga is so fucking retarded, bro. So anyway, what are you even saying? Anyway, what are you even saying? Sure that really matters, cause I already care this point. It's pretty fucking kind of dry. Really... You just don't go this outside of the standard. So I'm not trying to run out of a point here, toxic. Not gonna contend it being like a false equivalence. Sure, we can conclude. Let's leave it here. <laughs> toxic. If I sit at you, it pulls toxic, toxic. Let me give you an example, right? Let me give you a syllogism. Premise one. Why are you still trying to talk we, to me? Wait, I thought you one, bro, why, why are you still trying to talk two, to me? I disconnect you. Premise three, I mute, deafen, and disconnect you, right? Now, is that a real syllogism? No. Do I give a fuck? Oh, boy. No. If you told me that wasn't relevant, would I care? No, because it's not relevant to the debate being had. In the same way that every time you name something irrelevant to the debate, you say you didn't respond to this. I didn't respond because it doesn't fucking matter, Toxic. If you, like, tell me your mom's name is Gershwin, and I say, that's an imperial to authority. There is no burden on you in any reasonable Yeah, understanding I know you think it doesn't matter, but this, not, this, this is all circular reason. I know you think it doesn't matter, matter. Because you're retarded. So because every you're time retarded. we name an irrelevant fucking you're the same person has nothing to do with the truth value of my thing. thing. I like alcohol. And another person saying, I don't like alcohol okay. means the fact that for some reason that it pertains to language. Like, are you stupid? That's just the preferential thing. It has nothing to do with definitions, nor language. And I already explained how the loss of logic oh, so around what, wait, so what does alcohol is bad mean what, wait, what does alcohol is bad mean what does alcohol taste bad mean what does that mean it means it tastes bad what yeah what does alcohol taste good mean it means that it tastes good is one of those statements objectively correct um yeah exactly it is but whether or not it tastes good or bad to you is a preferential one thing, so it's wait, pause, that's actually dumb. i already one gave the argument section. just content the argument no, okay, shit. That's a false equivalent. Where are your R's? I just rise. Say contend the argument again.
Oh, you've gone quiet. So anyway, yeah, one or taste perception is in fact nothing that would allow this to be a jazz, right? We have different counts. I don't know how anything being, especially of the uh, that's what olfactory fucking nerves are the most varied ones in your body. Like I don't know where you got that, but this thing could objectively taste good from fucking way. But on a more Please. important note, you're mm-hmm. lost in the sauce. Okay. I'm lost in the sauce. Can, the same perception used to determine if something tastes good or bad is possible because the what the hardware used to generate this thing is possible. That it is has a not. False equivalent. I already told it's you. It's not but equivalent can, to yeah. fucking it. What am I... Where is the equivalent? You're giving an analogy to, to pertain... Yeah, you're giving that analogy to pertain... Sh- to sh- to sh- so again, you're giving me another fucking irrelevant that's false equivalent. It doesn't fucking matter, Toxic. You keep naming okay, classes so that's irrelevant. It's not equivocating. It's irrelevant. That's fine. That's fine. You're talking about equivalences because it doesn't fucking yeah. matter, you nerd. Yeah, it's fine. You can You did. You actual 5'4", 90-pound, soaking fucking wet. Grace's sure, sure, glasses sure, sure. having greasy 